Hello everyone. Welcome back to MedSurge Mentor. Today let's review a topic from cardiovascular system that is core pulmonale. Let's begin. First of all, let's see the meaning of the word core pulmonale. It's a Latin word that means pulmonary heart. Core refers to heart and pulmonalis means related to the lungs. Definition of core pulmonale. It is defined as disease of the heart characterized by hypertrophy and dilatation of the right ventricle secondary to disease of the lungs or its blood vessels. Common causes of core pulmonale are pulmonary hypertension, pulmonary emboli, lung tissue damage, acute respiratory distress syndrome, interstitial lung disease, sickle cell anemia, chronic obstructive pulmonary disease, cystic fibrosis, sleep apnea, scleroderma, lung cancer, and kyphoscoliosis. Now let's move on to the pathophysiology of core pulmonale. Due to etiological factors like lung disease, there is rise in the pulmonary vascular resistance. It leads to distension of the pulmonary vessels. Gradually, the pulmonary arterial pressure and the pulmonary vascular resistance increases, which is called pulmonary hypertension. Due to this, the right ventricular workload increases, finally leading to right ventricular hypertrophy and failure. Common clinical features of copulmonale are fatigue, dyspnea, chest pain, edema, palpitations, abdominal distension, dizziness, tachycardia, wheezing and coughing, exercise intolerance, enlarged neck veins, cyanosis, and increased jugular venous pressure. Next is diagnostic measures of copulmonale. Common physical examination findings are Elevated jugular venous pressure, hepatomegaly, murmurs, abnormal heart sounds, fluid retention, cyanosis, wheezing, and ascites. Other common diagnostic measures of copulmonale are arterial blood gas analysis, electrocardiogram, echocardiogram, CT scan, chest x-ray, ventilation perfusion scan, and cardiac catheterization. Next is management of core pulmonale. Common medical managements are diuretics, anticoagulants, digoxin, beta blockers, cholesterol lowering agents, antibiotics, bronchodilators, and oxygen therapy. Common nursing diagnosis for patients with core pulmonale are decreased cardiac output related to increased pulmonary blood pressure, impaired gas exchange related to pulmonary dysfunction, activity intolerance related to oxygen imbalance, ineffective breathing pattern related to altered lung function, Fear and anxiety related to the disease condition. Acute pain related to the inflammatory process. And knowledge deficit regarding the disease condition. Next is nursing care of patient with core pulmonale. Common nursing cares are assess heart sounds, lung sounds, vital signs and oxygen saturation. Administer supplemental oxygen and check ABG values. Teach deep breathing and relaxation techniques. Encourage small and frequent diet. Position the patient in semi-follows position. 
maintain strict intake output chart, encourage progressive physical activity based on tolerance, and administer cardiac drugs. With this, we are finishing the brief review of Cor Pulmonale. In short, it is a cardiac dysfunction caused by a primary disorder of the respiratory system. We have seen its definition, etiology, pathophysiology, clinical features, diagnostic measures, management and nursing care. Thank you so much for watching and see you next week with a different topic from medical surgical nursing.